guys, so here we're going to have the build for Layla Carrier Sin. I absolutely love this build. I don't know what it is about it, but I I adore it. <laughs> um, I wanted to completely gut the studio um, and start again. Um, Layla is kind of a hipster, but also kind of not a hipster. <laughs> it will make sense when you see the build, but she's everything's quite neutral. And I also wanted to keep it, because I live in a flat myself, I also wanted to keep it quite realistic how small it is, how the bathroom is maybe not exactly to what she wanted, same with the kitchen is not exactly what she wanted, you'll see when it all happens, um, but she kind of adds a few of her own touches in there to make it a little bit more special, if that makes sense, I hope it makes sense, it probably doesn't make sense, but you'll see what I mean. Um, I also love this concrete floor. I don't know what it is. I never actually use it in my own builds. I know I'm using it in this build, but if I'm ever building kind of on my Twitch or anything like that, I never use it. But I felt that it kind of suited Layla and it suited this apartment. Um, I imagine she probably pays through the roof for her rent for this apartment, even though it's tiny and there's nothing special about it. And it was obviously in the cheaper, air quotation marks, cheaper area of San Mancino. Um, she's got this horrible green wall as well. I really wanted that green to be kind of a little bit more grassy, if that makes sense. Does that make sense? Uh, nothing I say makes sense. You guys will know what I mean <laughs> when I say I wanted this room to be neutral. Um, so she pops in lots of plants um, and you'll see me doing that at some point. So just trying to figure out. I like, I'd, I've just realised how big this bathroom is. The bathroom does not need to be that big. She could have had such a bigger area without a bathroom being this big. Anyway, does the sink stay there? No, okay, I was gonna say, I hope the sink doesn't stay there because that looks awkward. <laughs> um, and I should put quite, I think I put quite a big mirror behind it. Um, but if you guys want to, and I do use a lot of custom content as well, I'm sorry. I know people don't often like people using custom content in builds because then I can't upload it to the gallery. But Layla is a custom content girl and I'm a custom content girl and I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Um, I also hate that. Isn't there a mod somewhere? I feel like there's a mod somewhere where that went really quickly. I think there's a mod somewhere where you can actually make those mirrors um, like functional. You can make them into medicine cabinets, I think. She has lots of makeup everywhere because I feel like me and Layla, we are one part of a soul. We are together. We are the same person and we are messy, really messy. <laughs> so she's got makeup everywhere and that just did not want to go there. Like, so I just delete it. Just delete it. Just get rid of it. Get rid of it, Ruby. So good. Did I put that there? I did put that there. That's cute. But this is what I was saying. So, also, how big headed. That's cute. Oh, that builds cute. Stop it, Ruby. Stop blowing your own trumpet. Anyway. Um, so, like I said, like everything is almost like it's been placed by the landlord and she can't really do anything with the bath and the sinks and the mirror and the toilet and all of this stuff. But she can put her own touches in, like the plants. She can put her own touches in like the, this. I mean, obviously you're gonna have soap in a bathroom. Um, I'd hope you'd have soap in a bathroom. <laughs> I mean, who knows? <laughs> oh dear. Did I put, I also don't remember if I put anything on the wall in that area. I hope I do because that looks fair. But if I don't put anything on the wall, that's realistic because I'm not allowed to put anything on the wall in my apartment. Actually, that's a lie. We can put things on the wall, but we have no hooks and we have nowhere to put the hooks. We have these really annoying lights that are actually outdoor lights that are just disgraceful. They're so bright. And what am I doing with those rugs? What am I doing with those rugs? There we go. That's an okay. That's the green I wanted the wall to be. Uh, and now it's bugging me that that green is not the right green. Oh, I'm not going to change it. I'm going to leave it as is. I also like that light. <laughs> anyway, what was I saying? I was saying something about my lights. So the lights we have are outside lights. I don't understand why they're in here. We've got them in every single room apart from the kitchen and they are so bright and garish and none of them really work. Like they work sometimes. And so because they don't work all the time, you don't always realize that they're on. And so like really late at night, I'll just be sat there and suddenly there's a bright light and it's really scary. Anyway, to the build, Ruby, we're talking about a build. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is what the majority of this is gonna be. It is just going to be me going off track. Do I put a plunger? I think I wanted to put a plunger there. And then I think I placed the plunger down. You know the one that's in debug? I think I placed the, pl the plunger down. And then it just... I mean, Layla doesn't do that. Okay, she doesn't need... She doesn't need one. She's cheerful, she's good, and she's a bookworm. 
Again, the green, the green that I wanted on the wall. <sighs> let's say, let's say. Let's say, how long does it take me to do this bathroom? <laughs> My word. Oh, do I put, maybe I do put something on the wall. I put that on the wall, do I? Oh, okay. That looks like it maybe came, that came with the house. The landlord will probably agreed that that wall looked too bare. So they were just like, we're just gonna put this light, this um, thingy here. I nearly said light, you guys know what I mean. It means picture. There we go, Layla is messy, like me. <laughs> she is, she's just too busy. She's too busy working. She's too busy enjoying her life. This room, okay, guys. Okay, I adore this room. When I did it, I did it, so I actually made this build months ago, so it's quite nice to see it again, because I made it maybe three, four months ago. I posted it on my Instagram, a picture of this bedroom, um, because I loved it so much. And I think that was like at least four months ago. Uh, but I really, really like, like I, I, feel, I feel like this is kind of a deligracy style room. So you know, like with the, because I never, never would normally have two different style bedside cabinets. In fact, normally I don't like using bedside tables slash cabinets, but I really like the gray and then the wood texture because again, it's like, she's she's kind of very woody. I mean, that's not the best way to describe it, <laughs> but she's very kind of relaxed and to nature and she loves nature, but she's not, she's not like a proper hippie. Um, she just likes plants, okay? And let her like plants, don't judge her. I love Layla. I do love her and I'm really really excited to play with her because I've got some like ideas in my head um, for what's going to happen to her but I'm also gonna like allow you guys to choose what's gonna happen to her um, you'll have to see you'll have to see what I mean um, but again I love this shelf and I really wish I decorated the walls before I did this but it makes sense why I didn't and I know why I didn't but I love this shelf this shelf reminds me of something I had at uni because again I've never lived anywhere that I'm allowed to actually decorate uh, so you're only allowed to place things you're not allowed to oh okay that does go there um you're not allowed to actually pin things to the walls so that's what Layla's done here again with all the mess on the shelves but she's just got lots and lots of stuff that I feel like maybe she's collected from the flea market um she probably goes to the flea market all the time gets her fresh fruit and veg that she definitely shouldn't be able to go and get because she probably can't afford it living in the city because I know that feel um <laughs> Is that all I put? Surely I put more stuff on the shelf. I wanted the shelf to look really, really full and really cluttered. I think I put more stuff on there. This is me trying to put a plant in this plant pot and it just doesn't work. So I'm just like, I'm just gonna get rid of it. I'm just gonna, just gonna delete that. Why is that going through there? It's quite a good way. Sometimes you can fit things in, it, like in the walls that don't come through the other side, but you have to be like really careful with it so it doesn't happen lots of stuff under the bed because do I wait do I actually put stuff under the bed Ruby you better you didn't put anything under the bed oh, my lord dearie dearie me okay I'm pretty sure most of this changes as well I wanted to put this little mirror here because I feel like I have a mirror right by my front door and I think a lot of people have mirrors right by their front door just because it's a lot easier um it's not easier I don't mean easier it's just my words are not happening and like when you're leaving the house or if someone comes and knocks on your door and you're not quite prepared, you need to make sure that your mascara is not down your face. At least I do. And I feel like Layla would. Layla's, Layla's I'm not saying I'm vain, but I feel like Layla would be quite vain because she's so beautiful. Like I, I'm in love with this sim. <laughs> I really am in love with her. She's so cute. She's so cute. And she has so much more style than me. Layla, can I just be you? <laughs> oh dear. I couldn't find a rug to go underneath here. I couldn't find one at all. Do I put, oh no, I don't put that. I'm so scared of using patterns. Like, so I've got the pattern obviously on the duvet and like, look at how long it's taking me to find a rug. Okay, I found a rug, everything's okay. Everything is okay. But I'm really scared of finding, using patterns, like too many patterns. But in real life, I use lots of patterns. But in The Sims, I just can't, I can't deal with it. I can't do it. What shelf do I use? I love this little nook. I really do love this. I mean, I'm no, I know I'm saying that about everything. Sorry to be big headed, but I love this nook. I, you'll see, but I do something really cool with the books in a moment that took ages. I don't know how long it's going to take on here, but it took ages in real life. 
um, and going up my mind, and it doesn't even look that good on the other side. Like I think you'll see me even flip around and have a look at it. I don't remember, but it just <laughs> took ages. Okay, <laughs> so deal with it. No, I was gonna say deal with it if it does take ages, but I will cut it if it does take ages. There we go. This is this is this is what I do. So let, there we go. Every single time, flipping round to make sure that it's not coming out too much. But I just wanted to have like books on a shelf, and it looks really good from the outside. Um, which I suppose is not really what we're going to see very often, but anyway, <laughs> okay. So what other books are we going to put on? A book sh Why? Why did I even get the book sign out? <laughs> yes, we need a book sign. That's definitely what we need. Do I put that there? Do I? Oh, okay. That that's probably yeah. Look how cute it looks. I think it looks really realistic. I'm sorry if you just heard my phone buzz. Um, but this oh, you're really hearing my phone buzz if you are. But this is exactly what I would have. Um, I don't have it anymore because I had it at university where I had my all of my windows lined with books and it just, they all got mouldy and sun damaged and I was heartbroken. But I didn't realise obviously until I left that house, which took ages. Um, I didn't do, like, I didn't really give myself much to work from here. Like look at how tiny this little space is. And in this space, I have to fit a kitchen, a dining room, and a living room. I mean, what was I doing then? Making a cup of tea, maybe, <laughs> probably. Uh, so I try and put. I, I end up loving again. I've said I love that. I love this apartment. We're not going to say it again. If I say it again, you're allowed to say mean things to me. Please don't. Um, <laughs> but I do love this kitchen. It's so teeny tiny. And again, again, I'm going to speak about myself. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm going to. But. Where I used to live in my old apartment, we had the tiniest kitchen. It was smaller than this one. That little touch as well on the, like having the letter by the thing. I love that. Well done, baby. Well done. Why, why did I even think that sink was going to be a thing? <laughs> no. Anyway, we had the tiniest little kitchen. Um, it literally didn't even have an oven. It had um, one of like the, the things that go over the top of the wow the hob is the word i'm looking for <laughs> the things that go over the top we had one of those um and then we obtained that sounds bad but we we actually salvaged a like a oven like a plug-in oven does that make any sense you know like it's like a, it's like a microwave but not a microwave and it's also not an oven but it was an oven a microwave oven i don't know but we salvaged one of those, so everything would be cooked from one of those. And because we salvaged it, it didn't have all of the parts. So, like, it didn't have any shelves or anything like that. So I had to use a cake tray. You know, like, one of the circular cake trays. I had to use one of those to put any anything on it. I had to use that and then put the little tray inside of it and cook things on there. And I managed to cook a whole roast. It wasn't a very good roast, but I did manage to cook a whole roast. Um... And we literally, we had so much cupboard space, but not enough counter space. Like, I think I only had one countertop. So as much as Layla might complain that she's got a small kitchen, actually her kitchen is huge. We have a big kitchen now and I love it. I say big, it's not big. It's it's bigger than the, the cupboard <laughs> we had before. Oh dear, oh dear. What am I popping in here? So I like, I kind of like the way it turns out. If anyone can think of anything else I could do with this kitchen, um, let me know. But obviously wait to see what it looks like at the end. Oh, I changed the fridge. I realised I changed the fridge now because that fridge doesn't look right, but I do change it. I hope. <laughs> I hope. Why am I putting a backpack in the kitchen? Ruby. <laughs> Stop. Okay. Actually, she doesn't have any counter space. Oh, it's realistic. It's so realistic. She doesn't have any counter space. Because I've put things on all of the counters, so she's not actually going to be able to use any of them, is she? I bet she goes into the kitchen, to, like, into the bathroom to make her... <laughs> Ooh, bathroom lasagna, my favourite. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, Lord. There we go. There we go. I double, do I double these up? If I do double these up... No, I don't double them up. Okay, somebody I watch on Twitch, and she's absolutely amazing. She also has YouTube as well, um, called Gitsy. She doubles up the YouTube... You, like what are they call like the hangers with the things on i've seen her do it before and it looked really good what's it called like with the knives and the forks and stuff i mean you're probably shouting at me for what it's called but she doubles those up and it looks really good and i don't know why i didn't do it i don't know why 
but you should definitely go and find her and follow because she's a good. Okay. There, I do. I do double it. Do I double it? I don't double it. Oh, I, oh, I double it. Yay! I do double it. Also, double is a very weird word. Um, I managed to actually put a little dining room in this area and it works out okay. Um, I've not actually used anything here yet. I haven't played with it. Layla's, Lay actually no, that's a lie. I think Layla has been in there and I took some screenshots of her. But I don't know. Like they might even be able to watch TV from the kitchen, which would be really cool. I love this. I just, I just love this build. And I haven't changed any of the walls. And I know that might be driving some people wild because I know some people paint the walls first and then put all of the furniture down. I don't, <laughs> I never do. I put all the furniture down and then I match with the walls, which is not, not right. I also love doing lighting in The Sims a lot, a lot, a lot, like a lot, a lot, a lot. Um, they just, they, they have amazing shadows and they're like, just the lighting in The Sims just really makes me so happy. And the shad, I like using shadows. I use shadows a lot in my builds. Um, I have a running joke about it on my Twitch stream where there is somebody who's also a YouTuber and a Twitcher called Zilria. You can actually find both of um, Gipsy and Zilria on my on my channel. You can click on their names and it'll come up. Um, you'll know what I mean. It's on there. I'm, I'm, I'm mumbling and, and just kind of going over my words a bit. But she hates anything. She hates my builds because they're always so dark. <laughs> she does. She just hates them. Uh, and it's a running joke that Zilria loves light. Not because of my builds, just because she loves it. She loves everything really bright. And then there's me just like, make everything dark. <laughs> make it so dark. Do I put anything else here? Don't tell me I put that there. Okay, good. I mean, it's kind of hanging off. Okay. I hope somewhere, somewhere, somebody has... Um, separated all of those up i bet they have if anyone knows of a, of a custom content with those handles separated let me know please let me know because i love those handles i do but they're huge and i would love to use them separately or just whatever and i also love this from vintage glamour it's so cute i don't think i end up using it in the end if i do i'm lying to you and i'm sorry those are the candles i was talking about I love the reflective services. I used to play The Sims on a really, 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 really rubbish computer for the longest time. Oh, I use this one. Yeah, okay. That's definitely more Layla, to be fair. It's 100% more Layla. Um, where we just had no reflections. I had nothing. <laughs> and now I can get reflections and I can get shadows and all of this stuff. It makes me so happy. It does. Do I make everything brick? I should have made it the brick of the outside. That would have made far more sense because obviously I'm trying to make it look like she can't change stuff. So hence having the brick and hence having kind of the awkward layout of stuff. Hmm. <gasps> she should have a date round here. Oh, I'm so excited. I really am. Again, with the reflections, you see in that um, wallpaper that I just put down, that's the slated wallpaper with the reflections. Of it. I love it. I don't use that, do I? No. 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 I love it, but it's not Layla. Do I just do that? Okay, that's what I have. Neutral colours. Neutral, neutral, but also girly. Layla! <laughs> oh. Concrete floor again. Do it. Concrete floor. Concrete floor. Oh, okay. Whatever. It's like I'm not listening to myself. It's like I'm looking at this five months later or four months, however many months it was. Again, I wanted to do this and... My partner joked about it as well because I wanted to have awkward placement of lights like the awkward placements in my apartment and it kind of works. I think I keep them or I think I change them about a little bit but I definitely put lights that just don't suit. Also, I love this little area. I don't know what it is but this is, I think I've already said that one of them is my favourite but I think this is my favourite area. I will do screenshots at the end of this to show you what it what. I, ju I just love it. I love the colours. I love what I put on the tables. Um, the things that go on the tables, I don't know, it shouldn't work. But it does. Um, I put this clock on and I over... No, I don't use that clock. I use the first clock we, use, we put down. I use that one. Just get back to that. And then I oversize it. 
Do you know what I mean? Like, it, it shouldn't work, but it works. <laughs> Again, but everything, everything looks, is everything's messy. There's something everywhere you're looking. There is something, apart from in this corner, maybe. <laughs> oh, d yeah, go on. Go on, Ruby. Put, oh, I should have put a little, I hope I do. I need to put more art. Well, maybe what I could do is actually have Layla paint some stuff. Um, or salvage some stuff. Like, we've got the, the posters that you can get from the, um, the what do they call them? Um, but yeah, so we're coming towards the end of the build now. So I'm just going to switch over to the screenshot. So here we've got the little front door nook um, area and the bathroom. I, I do really like how it turned out, obviously, as I've said so many times. <laughs> um, why do I take two screenshots of the bathroom? Oh, look at it, please. There's the bedroom, which I adore. Uh, but guys, so I'm going to leave a little link up in the top corner here uh, to our, to the speed build of Layla herself so you can actually see her. And then I hope you guys enjoy this build. Let me know if you think you need any changes and I look forward to speaking to you soon.